Waking up in the morning, thinking about so many things. I'll tell you how I'm doing. Not well, bitch. That's the holy whore. Jealous of what? Your ugly leather pants? Should I bow to you? Okay. Damn it. Bad weather, tornado, spin the truth, destroy. <laughs> Hello everybody, so welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beret Hills. Guys, I have some Persian tea for you that we need to discuss. But before we get into it, like always, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Do it right now. It really helps me a lot. If you are new here and you want to join the Beret Troop, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Hit the notification bell, guys. And let's talk about this mess. Guys, let's talk about Shots of Sunset. Okay, but I'm not going to go through the whole thing. I just want to really talk about this Mike, Reza, and Gigi situation. And the question that everyone is asking, is Reza the snake? Okay, if you, you know, if you saw the last episode, Mike basically said, admitted that he, you know, was sexting with this girl, inappropriate texting that he said it, you know. And... Also, at the same time, he went on and accused Gigi of creating spoof messages or something, some bullshit like that, trying to make him go down again and saying that Reza told him that Gigi was the one who sent those messages. Now, through everything that we have been seeing, at the end of the day, it appears that it was not Gigi, but maybe it was actually Reza sending those messages. So this is the thing that I do have to say, guys. First of all, yeah, I don't think that Gigi was the one behind the, those text messages. I don't even think that Gigi knows how to download an app to do that. Like, I don't, I don't even think that her head goes that far. I don't think that she is that invested on mics, you know? Like, she wouldn't give a fuck. Let's be honest. I think that she she's the kind of person who is like, you're cheating. Your wife knows that you're cheating. You're doing whatever you want. I don't care. Okay. Now, is Reza the snake? I don't know because we need to think, we need to see two different things over here. First of all, Mike is a compulsive liar. Okay. He has been actually caught on so many lies and these are not stupid lies of or like oh do i look fat or oh did you buy that no this was actually cheating lies more than once during her whole life like literally her his marriage ended because he cheated on jessica with a random girl you know and or more than one according to some reports you know so this whole story of Spooling messages, how is that different from the fact that first she was saying that someone hacks his iCloud and was sending, you know, the first inappropriate messages? It really doesn't make sense, you know? And also, I mean, Mike, she, he has been crying wolf so many times that it's very hard for me to believe that he wasn't the one also doing these messages, you know? Now, after what Reza did, especially with Gigi and the flowers, which honestly, guys, was one of the most savagest things I have ever seen on reality TV. That he will, you know, send flowers to everyone from Gigi doing like, you know, a special apologies to each one of them. But it was actually Reza. I, it was a mess, okay? I, I was amazing. Like, I love it. Like, the way that Gigi respond, it was insane. But he has this thing, and you know, the Reza will do whatever it takes to make great TV. Reza is a great producer, okay? So that's what it makes him so good for reality TV, because he will do whatever it takes to create the drama, right? So yeah, I could believe that Reza will do something like this, okay? But something is telling me that maybe he didn't. I just, I'm also on that boat that I think that Mike has been talking so much shit and she, and he has been cheating so much and he is a compulsive liar and a compulsive cheater that he just 
find himself lying and lying and lying and lying until you know the proof is out there and then he just needs to come clean but we have been seeing it so many times you know he literally lies on the confessionals to us all the time he's always like one thousand percent those text messages are fake yes i did take i did have inappropriate texts with a girl then he was like i one thousand percent didn't cheat on jessica Yes, I did cheat on Jessica, you know, and many, many other lies that we have been seeing for years now. Well, for the fans who have been watching for years, because to be honest, I watched the whole Shots of Sunset like this year. But, you know, so I, I even I have it more fresh in my mind, all the amount of shit that he has been doing. And don't get me wrong. I love Mike because he is cute and adorable and he is lovable, but he is not able to maintain a fucking relationship because he what Gigi said, I mean, I think he cannot be with just one person. I said it before, maybe he is also into polyamory as well. Because I don't think that he is able to be monogamous to one girl. So, um, but he just doesn't want to accept it. So, it's very hard for me to sit here and defend him and go against Reza. Because yes, even though we know Reza is a motherfucking shady guy... And he will be able to do something like this. I just don't believe Mike. And I feel that Mike is the one trying to do this and try to, you know, throw Reza under the bus. And in a couple episodes or a year, she's going to go out and say like, yeah, I actually was having an appropriate text message. Sorry, man. I love you. You know, so when is going to be enough? When are we going to have enough of Mike's line? Okay. Now, if Reza was doing it, is it bad? Honestly, is it is it that bad? Because maybe he was just wanting to know if he was still ha doing the shady thing. You know, maybe he just wanted to make sure. Because even, I mean, it is shady, but those two love each other. Like brothers, you know. So maybe he just wanted to know, like, okay, did you really learn from this? And are you actually going to respect Paulina? Or you are just another liar and this is another lie. So, I don't know. Now, Mike saying that Reza was the one saying that Gigi did it. It just go too much. That's also a part that really threw me away. Because it's like, why would Reza say that Gigi was the one when Reza, Reza and Gigi are actually in a great space? You know. And... It really doesn't make any sense, that part. I don't know. Like I tell you, there is something really, really fishy going on here. And I cannot get off my, of my mind that I think that Mike is the one lying again. You know, he has these messages. Maybe he, they, Paulina found them again. And now she, first, someone hacked his iCloud. Now someone is downloading special apps and sending messages that you will never know who sent them girl please i don't i can't honestly anyways let me know what you guys think on the comments below who you think is the snake it's reza is Gigi, or is mike line let me know in the comments below and like always don't forget to like this video share this video subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll see you around see ya bye